Hi everyone, this is me Pratyush, the founder of Proxlite, and I'm glad to present to you the very first native software builder from Proxlite, which is known as Proxlite Builder. So Proxlite Builder is a powerful tool that allows you to create TK Interbase GUI with ease. Its intuitive drag and drop interface make it simple for developer of all skill level to design, customize and export the Python application. Whether you are building a simple form or making complex application, Proxlite Builder has got you covered. So in the first edition of Proxlite Builder, we are adding certain features. The first feature includes drag and drop interface. So you can create effortless and arrange the widget on the canvas randomly. Now it also have this widget variety, which means it also include buttons, labels, entries, checkboxes, radio buttons and every single thing which are needed to create a very simple GUI based application. Now on right clicking, you open up a context menu, which allows you to cut, copy, paste and delete the widgets. Now the property editor allows you to change the color, theme, font and every single thing. Now in order to export your Python code, just click on the export to Python and it allows you to run and export your script directly to your native file. So this is the very first edition. You are always welcome to make modification to the code and then publish it again to our website. So you can over here, you can just click on this over here to download the releases, which are the recent releases basically. And you can also click on this community tab in order to get some themes and kind of templates which you can use for your next project. And even though you can check out the GitHub repository. So that's been said, let's start learning how to use Proxlite Builder. Now on opening the Proxlite Builder, you will see this empty canvas. Now this is where you can draw your entire imagination and build your application. Now. First of all, in the bottom corner, you can see the button, add widget, export to Python, copy, cut, paste and delete option. Now what this means, basically whenever you click on this button option, you are allowed to add widgets and select a widget that you are willing to add. So here's an example. So the button has been added. Now you can move this button on this canvas to the desired position and it is super easy to edit also. Now on clicking on this export to Python, it will allow you to save the entire GUI framework. Now this can be also used to cut, copy, paste and delete. Now in order to access this, you can simply click on over here, a right click will work and then you can cut, copy, paste and delete the widget. Now in order to add more kind of widget, you can also use this particular list. So this list contain a tons of different kind of options for adding different kind of widget which are available for TK Inter. We have integrated the custom TK Inter with it so that it looks more beautiful. As you know, the TK Inter applications are ugly. So we have integrated it with the custom TK Inter in order to create beautiful GUIs. Now you can click on this label and then click on add widget. This will add this kind of widget like a label. Now the next step is to edit the property. So simply double click on this and you can open this edit widget property. Now this tab will be opened over here. Now you can just rename this label like uh, let's say download. All right, now you can change the foreground and even the font. Now hit the apply button and this will change the font over here. Now you can even though customize the button over here or you can even though add any entry box. So for example, I have added a new entry box over here and drag it to the center. All right. So this is how this application has been created. This is a very first and simple application that we are going to create. You may can change the text, you may can edit it, everything like you can change this to hello world and change the foreground color to change it to red or you can change the font, font size, everything. You can just write your script over here. This is quite simple to edit this GUI. So let's see how can you export the final code. So simply click on this export to Python option. Now give it a name like example one and let's save it. So here is the file created out right there in the example folder. Let's open it up. So on opening it, you can see this very basic generated application which shows download and a button and a very simple URL field. Now this is how you can create modern and beautiful application just using the Proxlite Builder. So this is the very first and basic tutorial of Proxlite Builder. So we will be adding more tutorials to this series so that you can understand how to build cool application just using Proxlite Builder. 
I hope this complete entire project was really helpful for you. You can check it out on our store, you can check it out in our GitHub page and you can enjoy this application and start building your own modded application from scratch. Thank you for watching this video and if you find this video helpful then consider subscribing. Hit that like button below. I will meet you in the video. Until then, keep learning. Goodbye.